I think what we're trying to do across breast cancer is tailor treatment to the individual. So now, as opposed to six weeks of radiation for everyone, we know that for some women, shorter course radiation of three and a half weeks, which is a big benefit to them, works. We're studying partial breast irradiation for a period of four or five days. So I think that treatment is improving there. There is often an unnecessary fear of radiation. Patients don't always realize that radiating the breast, for example, doesn't make your hair fall out. It doesn't give you nausea and vomiting, things like that. So we still have a long way to go with our education processes. Patients, by and large, cannot accumulate the entire science of breast cancer in the short time period they have to make decisions. So I think in areas where there's clear benefit for patients, we as physicians have to be somewhat directive in our counseling and say, clinical trials have told us that for someone who has the cancer you have, this is really the optimal approach. Perhaps patient choice, if they don't have the information to make the choice, shouldn't always be considered the ideal. And in this information age where things can be up on the internet that may or may not have any scientific validity, picking out what's the result of a high quality clinical trial from what somebody just posted is also difficult. So I think it is a very difficult time and I think the one thing we need to emphasize is patients have time. There's no rush to make a decision and get operated on within a week of diagnosis. Breast cancer doesn't change that time period.